Ranga. He's got chocolates too, and she's like, "Oh my gosh, that's not everything." Oh. And awesome. he knows that above anything else, Marcella is a foodie, and so he's gonna just feed her the chocolate, and she's gonna tell him, "Hey, you should taste some." And so they're just being extra flirty. morning good afternoon and good night you're watching just a mom that sims i'm kt and i'm here today with another flavorful dream adventures so if you like my stories please like subscribe follow comment do all the things i appreciate it so much we are here with marcella and mouse we are in magnolia promenade marcella had called mouse she's tense right now and you could tell it seems she's suffocated by friendship he happened to be be over here already we actually we did not invite him she is opening shop now and we will be here for almost five hours she's pretty tense because mouse proposed in a previous episode and marcel is very happy about it however she's just letting old fears from being married get to her she was married to james for I believe 28 years. Their son, he's now 25. So just the way he treated her, it was a horrible marriage. She is just really scared to get married again. Oh my gosh. When you have returning customers that are ghosts, you know your food is bomb, baby. Let's give Jeffrey Landgrab the sales pitch because what he's here as a ghost that's the least we could do it's really just her letting her fears get to her that's a normal thing but it is against Marcella's grain because since the separation that James asked for she has clearly done everything seemingly without fear maybe she was afraid however she never let it stop her she opened her food stand she moved to a new house she didn't ask for half the Somalians she was brave even when she asked for the divorce dating didn't go well it was horrible it was horrible so she started to think that she wouldn't meet anybody people think that sometimes you know most people have probably been there before they found their one or made peace with themselves it really started to become real for her was when he proposed she was so happy in the moment she accepted without hesitation why because miles is a great guy he's lost someone she's getting nervous but i don't feel like she's articulated that well to miles it's okay to be afraid it's okay to be happy it's okay to be whatever but you have to let the people who matter around you and the people who support you know that real life lessons in the sims she's gonna propose them moving in together the mouse is coming by now and he's just happy to see marcella out doing well just having the paperwork attached the, the legalities attached is scary for marcella we are in stage three of four of our second aspiration in the home shelf hustle pack the the market magnet and she only needs one more thing she needs to sell a poor quality item for 100 simoleons have you had two ghosts come to eat your food ever um probably not because hopefully there's no ghost <laughs> Leo wants to grab something to eat later and says let's make plans so we'll definitely do that our sales day is about to end in seven minutes so i'll see if i can get nina to buy something they aren't happy with this puddle of water on the grass on the ground in front of the stand i mean i get it so let me clear the table and put this in inventory we made 1530 simoleons today so what we're gonna do is go over here and see if we can find a new outfit all right we're at the clothes store so i'm gonna try on some outfits she's gonna go on a date with mouse marcella has her outfit ready she is just gonna eat one of the baked alaskas from her sale and then she is gonna go ahead because it's seven o'clock and she's gonna ask mouse out on a date Miles and Marcella are out on a date, just enjoying each other's company, getting the date started, really. They're just going to get a picture real quick, and then they're going to go over here under this pavilion. They are slow dancing on the bridge. Their relationship is just a little bit lower than normal, still very high, but that is because of the tension. She's going to tell this engaging story about how life was for her. She wants to talk about 
how James was like a bear and other times he had her acting like a robot I'm afraid of the marriage part I want to be with you and I'm not saying that I don't want to marry you but I am scared he's saying I love you Marcella and she's saying I love you too like you have a strong mind you have a strong heart can we try moving in together first and I'm sure that I can overcome this with your help and Mouse is just saying as long as you're not playing a game with me and she's saying why would I I would never never play a game with you i do believe she's 49 and miles is 55 at this age if you haven't figured out how to talk it out then you won't mouse is feeling really confident at this point not just like killing it using his mind by utopia mouse wants to give marcella just some flowers and candy nothing too fancy mouse is just giving marcella a kiss on the cheek and He's giving her these flowers. It's just being really, really flirty. He's got chocolates too. And she's like, oh my gosh, that's not everything. And he knows that above anything else, Marcella is a foodie. And so he's going to just feed her the chocolate and she's going to tell him, hey, you should taste some. And so they're just being extra flirty. It is just so cute. I love the interaction. This is Miles and Marcella. Miles isn't going to pretend like he doesn't feel some type of way about her not wanting to go ahead and set the wedding date, but he thinks moving in is a good idea because more than anything, he's willing to take something over nothing. Oh my gosh, they're autonomously going to woohoo. Hopefully they're not running a million miles because they are running in the rain to go woohoo somewhere. They're woohooing in the observatory. <laughs> So I'm going to say they enjoyed their gold medal date. I don't even know if the date is over, but I did see that they got to gold. Look, fireworks are going off over here in the corner. We're going to go home now and get Miles moved okay, in. Okay, so Marcella is home and Miles too. He has officially moved in. He did leave some of his things. Miles is doing Marcella's gardening for her so that she doesn't have to worry about it. He's going to vigorously guarantee the plant life's future. Miles is just going to go ahead. He's just cleaning up everything for Marcella before she wakes up. I will have them go ahead and put decorations up. Looks good. It looks good. Can you please make a poor quality dish? Oh, dog. You can eat it. It's normal. Never mind. He wants to just give her a kiss because they haven't talked this morning. They are. He just wants to see if she wants to go with him on a vacation soon <laughs> take it easy but do take it so there's leo so he's saying maybe let's go on vacation together she's gonna say like how about we just have a party soon maybe they'll do that and go on a vacation later we really need to get somebody over here that cannot cook so that she can get this last part of this third piece of the aspiration. They'll go to Mount Kamarabi soon. Marcella's gonna go ahead and invite some people over for harvest fest these line up with our winter fest goals as far as we just need to grill yeah i have mal's grill i have him do three sisters chili she's just greeting everybody like hey kaori how are you thank you for coming she just wants to give her son leo a big hug she wants to be thankful oh hey eleanor she's already digging into this fish pie he's grilling so he's met that goal and harvest fest goals so he is looking great let's go ahead and tell a couple of jokes mal's has had already told her he would build a pool for her Marcella, go ahead and call everyone to the meal. Kayori, she's eating the fish pie, so Mouse's fish pie was pretty good. Mouse, you need to tell jokes. You could tell Eleanor a joke. Oh, they still haven't met. Dang, it's normal. I cannot get anybody to make a poor quality food. Well, they can just eat this cake as part of Harvest Fest. Eleanor, get you some cake, girl. You always have to pay for the food. Now you don't. I don't know why I told her to make eight of them. Goodness. That's okay. We're going to end this episode here. This has been a successful Harvest Fest already. If I click over here, Mouse is good. Marcella is good. I'm going to continue to work on our barbecue party side, though. Next time, we will be joining Mouse and Marcella on a vacation. Until next time, keep simming, be happy, and always have a blessed day. Bye-bye. Thank mm -hmm. you.